From amazing acrobatic arachnids to colourful dancers and bird eaters, here are 19 of the world's strangest spider species. Number 19. Colbat Blue Tarantula Found in the tropical rainforests of Southeast Asia, this animal is a medium-sized species of tarantula that is distinguished by its iridescent blue legs. According to the Oakland Zoo, the blue colbat can go for extended periods of time without food. A swift and aggressive hunter, it preys upon insects, other spiders, amphibians and mice, delivering a paralyzing toxin before dragging the meal back to its burrow to feast. Even though they mainly stay hidden in deep burrows, their unique coloration has made them a featured attraction in the pet trade. While they are pretty to look at, these spiders are very fast and they carry a strong venom that produces severe muscle cramps. The blue coloration is unusual, but it's not entirely unique to the species, as you'll soon find out. According to National Geographic, we are still trying to figure out why the tarantulas are blue. Number 18. Diving Bell Spiders Meet the spider that lives its entire life in a bubble, and we all know how important that can be at the moment. Also known as a scuba spider, they use its web like a gill. These arachnids are found across northern Asia and into Europe. Like many other spiders, they breathe air, but reside under the water using the diving bells for which they are named. Diving bells are constructed of sheets of waterproof silk and a protein-based hydrogel that are spun between water plants which are submerged. Because of this inflated air bubble, the spiders can exist underwater. The spider has to regularly replace its oxygen supply, but it can go a very long time underwater. Some say more than 24 hours. 70% of the spider's oxygen supply comes through the underwater web. Number 17. Whip Spiders This is actually neither a spider nor a scorpion, but belongs to a separate arachnid order called Amblypogy. If you're afraid of creepy crawlies though, this critter is not for you. While it has an odd appearance, this is actually a small, thin spider that is commonly seen in Australia. It is often found resting on a few strands of silk where it resembles a twig. While it may look like a twig, the whip spider is coldly efficient when it comes to trapping prey in its snare and devouring it. We used to not know much about them, but now researchers have discovered that they have all kinds of unique habits, all supported by some very unusual sensory organs. The front two have special sensory hairs and they whip them around constantly, giving them their name. If you're a small invertebrate, you better watch out. And now for number 16, but first be sure to subscribe if you haven't already and let me know your favourite spider in the comments below. Number 16, Flying Spiders While these arachnids are not capable of powered flight like birds, they're able to glide and soar through the air with the greatest of ease. They're small spiders measuring only 9mm, but they show off some big time skills. They're the only spiders known to date that can steer while gliding, so they can land on or in trees. Experts say they can attack prey from all sides, and they have some of the fastest turning motions of any terrestrial animal with legs. Are flying spiders coming now in 2020? Unless you live in Houston, Texas, you should be okay. If you are, just uh, watch out and it's windy and check your hair before you get in the car. Number 15. Spitting Spiders These spiders catch their prey by spitting out a fluid that will congeal into a sticky, venomous blob upon contact with its prey. You have to wonder if Spider-Man's web fluid wasn't actually inspired by this critter's abilities. While the substance is produced in venomous glands, it contains both the toxin as well as the liquid form of silk. A lightning quick attack can be executed from about 20 millimeters away, which will immobilize and weaken the target. After the prey is subdued, the critter will give it a venomous bite, then wrap it up in silk as per typical spider fashion. Number 14. Assassin Spiders These critters are also known as pelican spiders, since their long necks serve to support their huge elongated jaws. But make no mistake, they more than live up to their assassin nickname. These spiders prey only upon other spiders and are native to South Africa, Australia and Madagascar. But that scary name and appearance aside, these animals pose no danger to humans. They've been around for a long time though, from the Jurassic period to the present day. Number 13. Fishing Spiders While it's not yet a skill you'd normally associate with spiders, 
it seems that some arachnids have a taste for seafood. Researchers say that there are some five species of spider that will supplement their diet by catching small fish, and they can take down prey twice their weight and size. Some species are able to swim, dive, or even walk on the surface of the water. The creatures have been documented worldwide, but they seem to be most active in Florida wetlands. Spiders there have been observed to prey on smaller mosquito fish. Number 12. Scorpion-tailed spider. They're not a hybrid species of arachnid. The scorpion-like tail is actually part of the female's abdomen that tapers to a tail-like shape. When under distress, the spider will arc its tail as a way to deter predators, much as a true scorpion would. What's interesting to note is that only the females possess the tail. The males are smaller and more resemble ordinary spiders. Species of these critters are found from Australasia to Madagascar. Number 11. Gooty Tarantula Earlier, we told you about the Colbat Blue Tarantula. Now here's another example of a spider with a similar colour scheme. This arachnid is also known as a metallic tarantula, and is found in the forests of central to southern India. Similar to the Colbat Blue variety, they can be surprisingly fast and are known to carry a venom that can cause intense pain that can last for a week. Because they primarily occupy a 39 square mile area, the spiders are becoming even more rare. Harvesting and logging activities are increasingly degrading their habitat. Number 10. Ant Mimicking Spiders You'd almost believe it was an ant until you looked a little closer. It's actually a spider that mimics an ant. They do this as it provides a great disguise. They're so aggressive and unpalatable that predators, including wasps and birds, will typically avoid them. Did you know that there are more than 300 species of ant mimicking spiders out there? Number 9. Bat Eating Spiders Golden Orb Weaver Spiders are noted for the exceptionally large webs they spin, some of which approach 5 feet in diameter. The structures usually capture prey like flies, locusts, and small birds, but some species of these spiders have larger appetites, so they prefer larger prey, like bats. That sounds a little unusual, but researchers say that the bat-eating spiders are found all over the planet, although the vast majority are found in warmer climates. Females can grow nearly 8 inches long, which easily dwarfs the males. Spiders aren't the only invertebrates that have a taste for bats. Did you know that even giant centipedes, whip spiders, and even cockroaches are also known to feed on them? Number 8. Dracula Spiders These arachnids are a variety of Australian funnelweb spiders, so named due to the shape of their webs. Certain species are ranked as the most dangerous spiders on Earth due to their potent venom. That reputation alone should be enough to scare you off. However, this species isn't noted for possessing a lethal toxin, although it is known to bite humans. Dracula spiders got their nickname due to their red fangs. Researchers say the critters are difficult to study because they spend so much of their time in underground burrows. Number 7. Spiny Orb Weavers You can't miss the sharp spines on their back, and because of that, these animals are often called spiny-backed orb weavers. Makes sense, no? They can exceed about one inch in diameter and also have a hard, spiky, crab-like shell on their abdomen. Even though they look exotic, it seems they are rather common. Experts say they can be found worldwide and pose no threat to humans. Number 6. King Baboon Spiders Named for baboons because of their hairy appearance and pads on their feet, quote unquote, which resemble the texture and colour of a baboon's finger. Despite their fearsome appearance, these spiders are preyed upon by many birds and mammals. Ironically, that includes baboons. Number 5. Flick Flack Spider This arachnid with the odd name is found in Morocco and displays an acrobatic talent whenever it's threatened. To escape from predators, it will perform a series of backflips or forward flips in a cartwheel-like motion that resembles human acrobatics. When it's under enough distress, they can tumble at a rate exceeding 6.5 feet per second and even cartwheel uphill. 
To hide from predators, they will build a tunnel a foot deep and use it as a shelter from the hot desert sun. There are other cartwheeling spiders found in other deserts around the world, including the golden wheel spider in Namibia. Little by little, scientists are finding more of these tiny and impressive acrobats. Number 4. Jumping Spiders This family of spiders contains at least 6,000 known species. That's about 13% of all known spider species. It's no wonder that this is the largest group. They're easily distinguished by their eye patterns. Four sets of those peepers gives them some of the best vision found among any spiders. And as their common name suggests, they're very good at jumping. The largest of the species measures less than one inch, but they can jump several times their body length. We found estimates of jumps ranging from 6 to 50 times the length of their body, depending on the species. The jumping ability isn't just for showing off, it's a way in which they can attack prey, which is often insects. Number 3. Whip Scorpion Earlier I mentioned whip spiders. Now here's another creature with the same nickname, but it belongs to an entirely different species. In fact, it's also called the tailless whip scorpion, although it isn't related to other creatures with that name. Most experts say this animal isn't really a spider or a scorpion. They're typically described as an ancient order of arachnids that date back some 315 million years. With leg spans exceeding 27 inches, they don't possess silk glands or venomous fangs, but they are capable of grabbing fingers and inflicting puncture-like wounds. Overall, they're not regarded as a threat to humans, and chances are you're unlikely to encounter them anyway, since these arachnids prefer to stay hidden underneath bark or tree litter. There are more than 150 species that have so far been described, and they occur in tropical regions all over the world. You might have guessed that the animal's bizarre appearance makes it a popular subject in the pet trade. But if you get one, be prepared for the longer term commitment. These creatures can live up to 10 years in captivity. Number 2. Goliath Bird Eaters the giant huntsman spider is the largest when measured by leg span, which can approach nearly 12 inches. They're fast and scary beasts that dwell in the caves of Laos. So what's the largest spider when measured by mass and size? That's the Goliath bird eater, located in the rainforests of South America. This tarantula species can weigh more than 6 ounces, with a leg span exceeding 11 inches. While their fangs can penetrate human skin, their venom would be no more harmful than a wasp sting. As their common name suggests, this species has been known to prey on birds, but only on rare occasions. Number 1. Peacock Spiders These bright little spiders are adorable. With their cute little eyes and their little dance moves, it's hard not to like them. Although you might not even see them, to the naked eye, it's not easy, and they just look like jumping specks. Now, with better technology, it's easy to see them up close. True to their name, tiny peacock spiders display vibrant colours and patterns. And similar to their bird namesake, the male arachnids use those colours as a form of courtship display. But these critters are also known to bust out some elaborate dance moves to gain the favour of a prospective mate. And it better be an awesome performance an unimpressed female will sometimes try to attack and eat her suitor. Thanks for watching. Let me know if you'd like to learn more about spiders in the comments below. Be sure to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up for more videos like these. See you later.